All right, let's get right into it. So, uh, respect. Yeah, man. See, a lot of people now happen to have maybe not been trained or have forgotten about respect. Respect yourself. Respect others. See... I dealt with a couple situations that made me, well, not made me, but I felt compelled, forced to uh, make a video about respect, man. I remember standing in line, waiting to eat, and there was an individual in this line, he just was counting to himself. 100, 200, 101, 102, 103. And I said, hey, man, you in line? He just shook his head like this, kept counting 104, 105. And I said, hey, man, you in line? 107, 108. And he just like nodded his head a little bit more violently, right? He didn't decide to at least like go past me, go around, nothing. Just kept counting, man dealt with another individual standing in line to get my food and remember there's about 15 people behind me hey um do you think I can cut in line can I cut you like it's a joke why don't you ask the other people behind me if you can cut me then you got people who are all hungry just like me then you got someone in front. Do you think I could get a little extra, man? Hook it up, man. Well, if they hook it up for you, how are the other people going to eat? Then you got people who, you know, don't know how to hurry up and eat. You got people who want to play computer games and shit like that at the table. But there's a whole line of people standing here waiting to eat with their tray and you're still in your seat playing games and shit when you should just be eating. Do what you got to do and get the fuck up so someone else can sit. When you open the door. Look the fuck behind you. So. In case someone's behind you, they don't get hit by the fucking door. It's called common courtesy. See, a lot of people don't understand in certain environments, if you don't have respect, you can lose your fucking life, man, or get your ass whooped. Respect, man. I'm just telling you guys common things that people should be aware of. When I'm eating or when you're eating, imagine I pull out a tissue and everybody's eating. I'm just like. <laughs> No, go take that shit outside somewhere and blow your fucking nose, man. I don't want to hear you, your nose running and shit while I'm trying to eat, man. You know, you, you got people out here who don't know how to be quiet in certain settings. Yeah, you got people in the movie theater on their phone and shit always all on excuse me what happened to respect man when I grew up you these things were just second hand nature man I never thought I had to make a video about this you know I remember eating next to individuals who complained about the food they were eating Talking about this food's better in jail. This food's better here. Well, if it's so fucking better there, then go there, motherfucker. See, a lot of people, how I'm talking, when you talk to them like this, it's like a shock to them. Like they don't know respect. You know, I learned when I'm before I eat, wash my hands. After I'm done eating, you know, take a napkin, wipe, fold the napkin. You know, throw it out. 
you got people with the worst uh, table manners on earth, man. I don't know what happened to respect, but it needs to be brought back because (laughs) I almost took off on somebody today, guys. Yeah, man. I almost knocked somebody out today. You know, and I'm really not that type of person that wants to deal with those type of situations. But when you don't have respect, even the most basic amount, that gets me angry. And uh, you got a lot of people out here who don't understand that word, man. Got a lot of selfish fucking people. See, to respect is to, you know, think about others besides your fucking self. You know, Uh, I just I hate people who. Like they don't see anything else around them and they're only concerned about themselves. You know, a lot of people don't think, man. When you have to. Uh, live amongst people and share things and stuff like that you have to have respect man because see if you don't have respect bad things can happen (laughs) you know it's just sad now that it's just it's irritating honestly fuck being sad it's irritating man I get so irritated with people who don't have any fucking respect, man. Those are the type of people I want to motherfucking light up, man. And light up means knock their ass out. You know, in the military, when you're eating your food, there's no... (laughs) Yeah, yeah, yeah. Talking and shit. Group chats. There's other soldiers that need to eat, motherfucker. Hurry the fuck up, put your head down, eat your shit, mind your fucking business, don't worry about the table over here or who's laughing over there, eat your goddamn food, and keep it pushing. See, a lot of people, because of technology and shit like that, you guys really think everything's supposed to be fucking handed to you, man. You think you're super fucking privileged? You know? You you think that... You know... You're, you're above everybody else. When in reality... You're at the fucking bottom... Because your manners are trash, man. Don't be... These type of individuals. These type of individuals... Pick their nose in public. They... Uh, don't follow procedures how they should be followed. (laughs) They uh, they don't even respect themselves, man. They're pieces of shit. I had to make this video, man. Like, it's It just really irritates me that people don't even know the basic amount of respect. You know, they don't even know fucking table manners, man. Yeah. You got, you know, I remember I was eating and uh, there was this like can or whatever. And you, you know, you ash your cigarette or whatever the fuck in there. Motherfucker, I'm eating. Got my head down. I'm eating. Motherfucker gonna reach his goddamn arm over my shoulder to grab a fucking uh, metal jar to look inside to see if there's any extra cigarette buds and move his arm back. I was like, yo. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I didn't even get to finish my sentence. You know. Shit like that. Reaching over people. Not saying excuse me. Uh, not saying thank you or please. Yo, I'll tell you something, man. There's people like me out there that don't tolerate that type of shit, man. And you're lucky I'm military trained. 
because there's other people I know out there that if you tried any of that shit, step on their shoes, they, they'll knock your ass out, man, quick. <laughs> but um, I just wanted to make a quick video, man. What do you guys think about people and respect? These type of people don't have clean clothes. These type of people uh, don't give a fuck about what they say, if it offends you or not. These type of people are a waste of space. You know, I, I don't respect people who don't even know how to have basic manners, man. Fuck sitting at the table. How about pushing in your fucking chair, man? When you're done eating your fucking food, man. How about instead of, you know, you know those apps? These are the exact type of people they go eat at a fucking restaurant, leave everything all dirty, scattered trays, leave the lowest fucking tip possible. Oh, well, that's their job to clean it. Well, make their job a little bit easier and clean up after your nasty ass and fucking pick up after yourself. You know, these type of people's homes look like tornado cyclones and shit. These people look under their toilet seat, man. You want to know if a motherfucker dirty? Look under their toilet seat. If it ain't white, if it got any type of spots, then nope. That's respect, man. See, respect is when you know somebody's coming over your house, you clean up. Respect is, like I said, pushing in your chair, saying, please, thank you. You know, uh, when I, when I grew up, elbows off the goddamn table, man. Get your fucking elbows off the table. Uh, it, you know, and my my pet peeve is people who fucking blow their nose. There's so many of these goddamn people. Please don't be one of these people. Don't be this guy. Everybody's eating. I'm enjoying some super good food. And then I got to hear you blowing your fucking nose or right next to me. And and then and then, <laughs> yo, it ain't <laughs> you see this shit right here. This is your shield. You, you, you put your you, you cough in your motherfucking arm. man. I don't I don't get it, man. What the fuck happened to respect? Yo, let me know down in the comments what you guys think of these fucking whack ass, no respect having motherfuckers, man. And if you're one of these people, look, I'm not knocking you down, but you got to get the manners right, man. You got to get some respect because I'm telling you, I was literally that fucking close to hurting somebody today. Because my arm was just starting to like, you know, a slingshot. It just started going back, man. I was about to, man. Because he, he wasn't answering me. I said, yo, I asked you two fucking times. Are you in line? You're standing in the line. And there's a, I, at first I was like, is this guy good? Like, what's wrong with this guy? There's a whole, you know, when you see the whole gap in front of somebody in front of you and you're like, uh... Hey, man, that's what happened. And he just kept sitting there counting and counting and counting. Now, I know maybe he had the mental disability. Maybe he had whatever, right? But he didn't have none of this. You know, it, what pissed me off is you couldn't even have enough respect for me, the person behind you waiting in line, thinking you're in line. I had enough respect to not pass you thinking you're in line. And you disrespected me and just kept counting. You didn't give a fuck about what I was saying. You, the second time when I raised my voice, he made sure he shook his head more violently and shit because he knew I wasn't fucking playing, man. And you guys, I don't want you to be like how I am. I'm still learning how to, you know, not be so aggressive from the military nature and shit like that. But there's just certain things, man. If you don't have respect around me, don't be near me because I'm not playing that shit, man. You know, I remember uh, today, too, I walked past a certain area. 
And even these homeless people don't have enough respect for the area they sleep in. I've seen about minimum 20 vodka bottles. And obviously vodka is clear. These shits were dark, piss round, yellow. Like you could tell they pissed in these bottles and they were just scattered all over the field. No respect. Yeah. I'd rather have you piss on the ground and not make any uh, bad. Uh, what's what's the word I'm looking for? I'd rather have you piss on the ground than ruin the than ruin the environment. Now, why, Jay? How is he ruining the environment? Pissing on the floor is going in nature in the dirt. Pissing in a bottle and then closing it and leaving it on the floor is fucking polluting the planet. Sad, man. Yeah. But let me know what you guys think of people who don't got no fucking respect, man. I don't respect people who don't have respect. You know? I met a couple people in the military who thought they weren't going to be respectful. And their asses turned out fucked. That's what happened. These motherfuckers got uh, the full extent of what the military will dish out to you if you want to play disrespect. I've seen people get their ass whooped. I've seen people get demoted. I've seen people be put in prison from the military. And I've also seen a lot of other shit. <laughs> that I can't uh, say on these videos but uh, yeah man let me know what you guys think of disrespectful people man I can't handle them man I can't be around them nasty it's, they're, they're a disease man but uh, y'all hear that man do y'all hear that man I know I hear something I think it's a motherfucking nothing <laughs> man Yo, respect yourself, respect people around you. And if you don't know how to do that shit, well, better fucking learn, man.